required permit? A third party is required. What was Donald's mother doing here? We were having a chat. About what? A third party is truly required, Father. No, sister. No third parties. You and me are before talking. attempting to destroy my reputation. But the result of all this is going to be your removal, not mine. What are you doing in this school? I am trying to do good. Even more to the point, what are you doing in this priesthood? You are single-handedly holding this school and this parish back. From what? Progressive education at a Walter in church. You can't distract me, Father. This isn't about my behavior, it's about yours. It's about your unfounded suspicions. That's right, I have suspicions. You, you know what I haven't understood through all this? Why do you suspect me? What have I done? I want to know. You gave that boy wine to drink and let him take the blame. It's completely untrue. Did you talk to Mr. McGee? All McGee knows is the boy drank wine. He doesn't know how he came to drink it. He's not have something to add to that. No. So that's it? There's nothing there. I'm not satisfied. Well, if you're not satisfied, go and ask the boy then. He protects you, that's what he's been doing. And why would he do that? Hmm? Because you have seduced him. You're insane. You've got it in your head. You're right, corrupted this child to giving him wine. And nothing I say will change that. Correct me if I'm wrong, this has nothing to do with the one. Not really. You had a fundamental mistrust of me before this incident. It was you. You wanted Sister Jackson to be on the lookout, wasn't it? That's correct. So you admit it? Certainly. Why? Jens is convinced I'm innocent. Oh, so you talked to Sister Jens. Hmm. Well, of course you talked to Sister Jens. Did you know that Donald's father beats him? Yes. And might that not account yes. for the off behavior it Sister Jens? convince you so truly. On the first day of school year, I saw you touch William London's wrist, and I saw him pull away. That's all? That's all. <laughs> That's not... Why? 
You have to be removed as principal of this school. This morning before I spoke to Mrs. Miller, I took the precaution of calling the last parish to which you were assigned. What did you say? Who? The pastor. I did not speak to the pastor. I spoke to one of the nuns. You should have spoken to the pastor. I spoke to a nun. That's not the proper way for you to have taken. Sister, the church is very clear. You're supposed to go through the mass. Why? Do you have an understanding, Unity? Father Flynn, you have a history. You have no right to go rooming into my past. This is your third parish in five years. Call the pastor and ask him why I left. It was completely I'm innocent. I'm not calling the pastor. I am a good priest, and there is nothing in my record to suggest otherwise. You will go after another child, and another, until you are stopped. What nun did you speak to? I won't say. I've not touched a child! You can! You have not! Slightest proof of anything. But I have my certainty. In arm with that, we'll go to your last parish and the one before that. I will find a parent, Father Flynn. Trust me, I will. A parent who probably doesn't know you are still working with children. And once I do that, you will be exposed. You might even be attacked metaphorically or otherwise. You have no right to act on your own. You're a member of a religious order. You've taken vows. Obedience, anyone. You answer to us. You have no right. Step outside the church! I will step outside the church even though the door should shut behind me! I will do what needs to be done, Father, even if I'm damned to hell! Believe me, or you will mistake me. Now, did you give Donald a little wine to drink? Have you never done anything wrong? dog that bites is a dog that bites. I do not justify what I do wrong and go on. I admit, desist, and take my medicine. Now, did you give Donald Miller wine to drink? No. Mental reservation? No. You lie. Very well, then. If you won't leave my office, I will. And once I go, I will not stop. Wait! Thank you. You will lose. You 
You can't know that. I know. What is your compassion to? No worries here. Stay here. Compose yourself. Use the phone if you'd like. I have no sympathy for you, Paul. I know you're vulnerable to true regret. Please do. And cut your nails. And see. 